Hey guys, Uncle Dwayne again. And um, today I want to talk about something that is going to be on sale for Black Friday this year. But not only Black Friday, but for all the days leading up to it. And this is something, it's not like a television or a car, things which you buy. And after you buy them, they start losing value from day to day. This is something that you buy, and when you buy it, it goes up in value. And on top of it going up in value, it also pays you money throughout the year sometimes. What I wanted to talk about Um, which would be on sale for Black Friday this week and the others following, is fundamentally sound stocks at their annual low price. As you know, every week I put out uh, this week's stock winners, which lets you know which fundamentally sound stocks are at their annual low price, and it's a good opportunity to take advantage of those. So I recently, I just put one of those out, um, which covered November 13th through 17th of 23. Um, We know this is um, the 20th, so that it covered last Monday through Friday. And now we're at Monday again. And in this, I want to point out to you, I'm just going to show you five of the stocks that were recently brought up in this week's stock winners from November 13th to 17th. Now, I break my stocks down into three tiers. Three star, which is the top rated tier and the most fundamentally sound. Two stars, which is a little below that. And three star, or and one star, which is the lowest rated. Still considered fundamentally sound, but the lowest rated among them. I'm picking the first five three tiers that I brought up in here, or three stars that I brought up in there for that week. So first we start with Sensian Technologies. And Sensian Technologies is a sort of unique company. What they they actually are business to business. They sell their services to businesses. And what exactly do they sell? Well they sell colors like if you make makeup and things like that they sell the colors for those they also sell flavors businesses that make candies and so forth they need those artificial flavors sentient technologies makes those now we realize 2022 has been a rough year lots of stocks fell for 2022 But I just want us to look back at, like, let's go back for the last five years, so starting from 2018. If we look at Sensian Technologies at their annual low price in 2018, it was $47.76. It moved up to $70 that same year for the high price, but it moved up to $102 for the high price four years later, 2021. We know in 2022 it dropped a little to 96. So that's easily more than 100% return on your money. Let's go to the next one. Keysight Technologies. And Keysight Technologies, if we looked at it 
in 2018 at the low price it was $42.15 a year later 2019 it was already up to $109.08 so that was already more than a 100% return but if we look at it in 2021 it was at $207.93. That's more than, that's around three, 300%, 400% return. Let's go to the next one. Next, we have Hershey Company. For those who like Kit Kat and so forth, or even the Hershey Bar. Sure, you're familiar with the Hershey Company. Well, the Hershey Company was at $79.69 at its low price in 2018. If we move up, well, that same year they moved up to $100.83. But if we go four years later, they moved from $79.69 to $187.43. And in 2022, they didn't drop. They actually moved up to $238.01. Let's look at our next one. Next one is Agilent Technologies. Agilent Technologies in 2018 their annual low price was $58.81 a share and by let's see actually if we go two years later 2020 they had already moved up to one hundred and seventeen dollars and twenty eight cents at their high price twenty twenty one it was a hundred and seventy seven dollars and three cents it dropped a little in twenty two and paycom paycom really dropped this year great company but they really dropped from a bad earnings report. Or not necessarily a bad earnings report. Let's say a surprising earnings report came out with some news in it that surprised the financial world. You can find all that information about Paycom on my channel. I have two um, videos on there. One is about what happened to Paycom because they dropped dramatically in one day. And the other is the um, the stock analysis on Paycom. In any event, Paycom, $80.22 a share for the low price in 2018. By the time we get to 2021, Five hundred and fifty one dollars and seventy seven cents a share at its high price dropped a little in twenty two well one a little dropped to four oh three but that's definitely higher than eighty and we know it dropped this year we'll see what happened when you read the uh or look at the videos in my channel speaking about it. So those are things that you can acquire on Black Friday that are not going to decline in value. They're actually going to increase in value. And I showed you where they increased in value, but a lot of these stocks even pay a dividend. So you're not just receiving the increase in value, you're being paid a dividend for your money on the side. 
and we have a couple of videos in the channel talking about S block where if you get an S block that's a secured back line of credit you if you have twenty five thousand dollars in stocks you can actually borrow against that money at a very low interest rate and not have to make regular monthly payments so in that case you can own your stocks excuse me you can own your stocks and while you own your stocks you still can go out and buy the things that you need to buy and so forth while your stocks are growing in value but we're looking for this friday because it's black friday and everything is cheaper i know my my wife is gearing up to get out there and take advantage of the cheaper prices that you find this time of year but in actuality, every day in the stock market is a Black Friday. Because every day in the stock market, there are pro stocks that are going to reach their annual low price. And if they're fundamentally sound, that's the opportunity for you to just buy them up and bide your time. and. As I mentioned before, in each week's edition of this week's winning stocks, I talk about exactly what those stocks are and show you how they've been moving up on the candlestick chart. So in any event, guys, this is Uncle Dwayne checking out. You guys have a great day and have a great Thanksgiving.